So here we are at Lesson 90 from the Workbook of A Course in Miracles. Lesson 90 is a review lesson covering lessons 79 and 80, and it is the final lesson in the second review section of the workbook. So Review 2 covered lessons 61 through 80, and we're completing it today. Lesson 90. For this review, we will use these ideas. Lesson 79. Let me recognize the problem so it can be solved. Let me recognize the problem so it can be solved. Let me realize today that the problem is always some form of grievance that I would cherish. <laughs> Let me also understand that the solution is always a miracle with which I let the grievance be replaced. Today I would remember the simplicity of salvation by reinforcing the lesson that there is one problem and one solution. The problem is a grievance, the solution is a miracle. And I invite the solution to come to me through my forgiveness of the grievance and my welcome of the miracle that takes its place. Specific applications of this idea might be in these forms. This presents a problem to me which I would have resolved. The miracle behind this grievance will solve it for me. The answer to this problem is the miracle that it conceals. And lesson 80 let me recognize that my problems have been solved. I seem to have problems only because I am misusing time. I believe that the problem comes first and time must elapse before it can be worked out. I do not see the problem and the answer as simultaneous in their occurrence. This is because I do not yet realize that God has placed the answer together with the problem so that they cannot be separated by time. The Holy Spirit will teach me this if I let him. And I will understand it is impossible that I could have a problem which has not been solved already. These forms of the idea will be useful for specific applications I need not wait for this to be resolved. The answer to this problem is already given me if I will accept it. Time cannot separate this problem from its solution. That was lesson 90, a review lesson. If you'd like to read my commentary on the workbook this year, just go to amytorresasim.com and click on Amy's blog. Namaste.